Greetings. A few days ago, I had faced a problem connecting my printer wirelessly, and this is one of the most common problem we face. Hence, I would like to share the resolution to this issue so that we can all resolve it without much difficulties and as quick as possible. Now, I have my printer, which is an HP OfficeJet 6500, connected via an Ethernet cable to my Linksys router and it is not connected wirelessly. As I had mentioned that my printer and my router is connected using an Ethernet cable, so I'll go to my printer's EWS page. In the address bar, I'll type in my printer's IP address Great, we are here on the home page. Now I'll move down to network connections. It shows that the wired connection is connected and the wireless is a no here. Now I'll go to networking and then I'll click on the wireless under connections. Now it gives me an option to click on the start visit, so I'll hit on the start visit option. Now we all see it states no wireless network found. Once I hit refresh to check for wireless network, and it has not detected any wireless network. However, my computer is connected wirelessly. To prove it, I would move to the Linksys EWS page. So I'll type in the IP address. Alright, so I have my Linksys EWS page opened up. So what I'll do I'll go to wireless and at the moment we are under basic wireless settings. Now we do see that the wireless channel is set to 12. Now this is a need to know information. In US and Canada we have wireless network ranging from 1 to 11. And by default, it is set to 6. There are two possibilities why my printer is not detecting the Linksys router. First, it might be set on the N mode. And in this case, we need to change it to the G mode. Secondly, it could be because of the channel why the printer is not detecting the router. So I'll click on save settings after changing the channel. Settings are successful. Now I will go back to my printer's EWS page and I will click on refresh. Here we go, it did find the Linksys router. So I'll click next. Now let me go down and it is asking me to type in the WEP key. So I'll feed in this information. And now I'll click on finish. Let me go down. All right, I'll hit finish here. I'll hit OK. Now to double check whether my router and printer is connected wirelessly, 
what I'll do, I'll go to the command prompt. Here, I'll ping the printer, which is hardwired at the moment. And then I would remove the cable. And it would give me request timed out three times and after which it would ping again, which means my printer is connected wirelessly. Great, it is connected wirelessly. Now, just to show you once again, I'll move down to network information. And here, the wide network is a no, and the wireless is a yes. Hence, we did resolve this problem. It's one of the most common problem we do face, and this is the easiest and the most effective resolution to this problem. Just for your information, a lot of router nowadays comes with the N mode, and the printer is not able to recognize the router sometimes. For that, you have to change it from the N mode to the G mode, as I've mentioned earlier. I hope I did answer a lot of questions pertaining to this topic. Thank you so much and I'll see you again. Bye-bye.